The Iranian state-owned press TV service has been taken off the air in Britain after its licence was revoked by the broadcasting regulator Ofcom. The station was fined £100,000 by Ofcom last month for broadcasting an interview with the journalist Maziar Bahari, recorded under duress while he was imprisoned in Iran. Our international editor, Lindsay Hilson, reports. Possibly that's an administrative... Uh, Do thing not adjust your set. At 15.03 this afternoon, the Iranian television station Press TV was taken off air in Britain. The story starts with this footage, broadcast on Channel 4 News in 2009. It shows Iranian government paramilitaries shooting into a crowd of protesters after Iran's disputed elections. The pictures were filmed by journalist Maziar Bahari, who then appeared on Press TV himself. I sent a report about the attack to Channel 4 News as well as to Newsweek magazine. But Bahari wasn't a free man. He had been detained, tortured and accused of being a spy. I was taken into an interrogation room and I was given a choice. I could do an interview with government media, including press TV, or face execution and death. It was not a very easy choice and I chose to be to do the interview. And during the interview with Press TV, my, my interrogator was in the room and he was feeding the Press TV quote-unquote journalists the questions. Bahari, who came to the UK after his release, reported Press TV to the TV regulator Ofcom, who fined the broadcaster £100,000. Today, Ofcom ordered Sky to drop the station from its satellite because it had refused to pay and had failed to prove that it had an independent editorial board, as required by the licensing authority. Press TV had other explanations. Maybe the ruling was in reaction to its coverage of the UK summer riots, or... Press TV also aired some analysis of the 2011 royal wedding in the UK, which many in the country describe as extravagant. Ofcom is said to have close ties to Britain's royal family, Last November, demonstrators attacked the British Embassy in Tehran after the UK imposed new sanctions against Iranian banks because of Iran's nuclear program. On Monday, the EU will impose further sanctions. Today, Press TV accused Ofcom of subservience to the British government and the monarchy and said British viewers could continue to watch online.